Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are diving into a topic that is both urgent and eye-opening. The harsh reality of being a software tester in 2025. With AI, with automation and shifting of developer dynamics, reshaping the field. Let's break it down the five biggest challenges that testers right now are facing and how you can basically tackle them. Let's get started. Okay. The first one which I have seen is the role evolution and obsolescence. What do you mean by this promo? See, nowadays, what I have seen, guys, if I'm not sure if you are know this, I have recently launched a QA job board where last three months I have talked to 50 plus HRs. This is what we have figured out that manual testers' jobs or manual testing jobs, you can say that are almost getting obsolete. So it means that adding automation is the only solution nowadays to get the number of codes. So if you have a five years experience, anyhow, you need to fake it till it make it. This is what the word things is. You need to add minimum of three years of automation experience into your profiles. Anyhow, by you need to justify with your project. So this is what which is happening right now. Another interesting thing which I have noticed is good product based companies where, for example, many, many good companies like Atlassian and everything where developers are increasingly handling the test automation rather than QA resident people where developers are actually started handling this. So manual testers, they have to spare the issues because of the lack of automation. Instead, they wanted to learn automation. Now, the, another thing which basically comes in, which is the third one, which is AI, where self-healing things, generators, AI operators, agents and everything is also coming side by side. So manual tester, wake up call for you guys, add automation plus AI, both of them into your system. This is what that type is happening. So the only solution, no, I'm not only talking about the harsh reality with problems. Solution also here I want to give you, which is guys adding upskilling is important. You need to add your automation, Selenium Java with API testing into your profile. If you are want to get the jobs, we got seven out of 10 jobs are very related to Java. That's why it is important. Second important point is adding the AI knowledge, like generative AI, how to create agents, how exactly you can use different LLMs and all things that is also becoming a very, very important. All this we have already started. If you are aware or not, job ready automation, new batch where we have basically added our generative AI as well as agent details and everything is also launching. So make sure you check it out where we will be covering the Java. So all this, uh, all the topics and everything. So this is the exact roadmap that we will be following up. 11X batch, which is basically getting started where Java API testing and Selenium with the rest assured and postman Maven test ng custom hybrid frameworks from scratch that we are basically creating, which are Selenium ones, as well as the API ones that we are basically creating from scratch with Cucumber VDD and everything that we are starting out. So that thing are important to add. Second thing, which is the automation overload. Guys, if you are already an automation or a tester or something, right, you will see that 40% of your time is basically going with the flaky scripts right now. Even nowadays, people are telling that add automation, add automation, add people in the automation, right? Companies budget is basically getting high. I remember in Browse Tech, we have hired a lot of SD and everything their salaries was very very high at the time so those things also is happening even the flaky test cases and everything this is a problem this is a harsh reality right this so the first one was basically related to manual but this is the second one which is automation even adding automation is flaky and everything that you need to use of course the solution is basically using selenium self-healing scripts and ai driven things which are basically coming more and add the maximum roi do automation for only p zeros and p1 important pipelines and hot fixes which solve the major problem that which is we are right now seeing okay another important point which is talent shortage and crushing the workload what do you mean by this see overall the qa right now are get crushed by the workload i have seen where testers are basically juggling with three four projects they are not able to automate the people who have hired as an automation they are doing manual administrative task and lot of cross collaboration that they need to do that basically leads to what we call the workload overload right overload i can say and finding the good talent shortage is is also the problem that I have seen. Guys, I right now I'm, I'm working in Tikion and where we have handled 30 plus, right now I'm handling 30 plus QAs. These things that I have figured out is that finding a good automation tester nowadays is very difficult. It is very difficult. People are in a comfort zone. Lot of people as a manual tester, fresher and non IT, even automation tester are in a comfort zone. They are not learning new things. Apart from learning the couple of concepts, they are not learning the concept of CI, CD, Docker, AWS, even the AI, how exactly they can leverage, they are not interested. Comfort zone in case of manual testers is very, very high. If you are already manual tester, I cannot fathom, right? How much comfort zone you guys are in right now 
now i have seen people with 10 years 12 years into the industry and they are still not basically adding automation adding ai details into their resume which is very very scary so you need to add it this is the harsh reality another important thing which i want to mention is the generative ai thing what do you mean by that what is that see right now ai is basically coming in a very fast way where i remember in one and a half year back we have heard about something called as chat gpt playground and everything and now today what we have seen is we have ai agents where they can take the requirement create a test case create a test plan write your scripts of selenium and do multiple things so which is very scary for this right so you need to make sure that these skills which you need to add it cyber side nowadays github copilot crew.ai lot of ai tools which are basically coming right now they are helpful to you guys the person who knows api or ai sorry will definitely going to replace you if you are not learning this so that is very very important the forever student dilemma is very very modern which is the last one which i want to discuss this is a harsh reality which is if you are a qa then you are always a student please remember because the most important thing is testers must learn the new techniques which are basically coming have to learn things related to ai blockchain quantum computing new skills which are coming also the traditional certificates which are basically they are like for ist cube and everything right for catalon and tosca right those are becoming irrelevant i i think so which are there so you need to add more and keep adding more and more skill you have to be a forever student which is very very important that you need to understand so there you have it the raw through shaping the software testing in 2025 yes the road is tougher but also it is packed with the opportunities for those willing to willing to adapt whether it is mastering the ai ethics automation right adding skills championship or quality whatever it is your role is basically involving it is not disappearing this is the most important thing that you need to understand apart from this software testing is not going anywhere so that is the most important thing you need to remember and of course new batch of automation job ready is basically live link in the description make sure to check it out i have added special generative ai session and the couple of things which are basically we are learning related to ai agents operator and everything which are new coming deep seek and everything i have added here in this course right you can check it out link in the description it's a live course 3 to 4 months our target is to become an automation tester especially as a manual tester to automation our target is 3 4 months if you have a coding fear and everything i will take care of this we will be doing more than 400 500 live exercises we will be doing the daily task that i am going to show you like this for example daily task we will be, we have we are going to do like we have done it in 9x batch daily doubt sessions also we are going to have it in the in class as well as documented and you will see jobs and referrals also we are going to give you side side all right so i'll see you in the live batch uh, link in the description make sure you check it out i'll see you thanks a lot for watching bye bye